vegetables I kept in the... I have warned you countless number of times to mind the kind of dirty, smelling things you put in that fridge. Wait. Chiba, did you put my vegetables inside the dustbin? How dare you? What will you do? Hmm? What will you do? Shameless best wife. Disorganize my waist. Then why are you sounding like this? You're hurting my feelings. Look, I had a very busy day. Now I want to rest. So you can go to your room. Norma, don't touch me. Go to your room. I'm tired. Don't come. I have a source that this country is going to experience a high degree of oil and gas scarcity in the shortest possible time. For this reason, I've decided to buy enough of this commodity that will last me for some years. I have a reservoir that can contain 50 million liters of these products. Jesus. <laughs> That's wonderful. Thank you for the compliment. <laughs> yes. 
This is why I needed a loan of 500 million naira from your bank. I have made arrangements with Mercury Bank PRC for another loan costing 500 million. This business, as you know, will cost me a whopping 1 billion naira. They have started processing this money, and I hope that they will be ready with it by tomorrow or next. Okay, Chief. Uh, you are one of the biggest customers we have. You see, it has always been our pleasure transacting business with you. Well, thank you for that compliment. Um, like I said before, time is running against me. This is why I invited you over to come, so that this transaction will take effect immediately. Um, this is a file containing the documents for the filling stations. I have given Mercury Bank the one containing the documents for the gas plants. Uh, that's all right. Uh, for formality's sake, we have to confirm these properties before we can go into the transaction proper. Well, as you can see, I have no problem with that. Just conduct your normal investigations and uh, get back to me within the shortest possible time. That's all. That's all right. I have to take my leave now. Yes. It has been my pleasure conducting business with you, and I hope to see you again. I <laughs> Baby. 
Nonene hasn't come back till now. So you want me to start bothering myself now about Ononeni's whereabouts, eh? If he doesn't want to come back, let him stay wherever he is. Now, I have my business to attend to. Let me tell you, that business is my top priority now, and I don't want any distraction from anybody. I am only worried about the 30,000 naira I gave him to buy something for me from the market. That's why I'm worried. Yeah. Oh. Uh, <laughs> the best spirits in the whole wide world. <laughs> yeah, that, how are you? I'm good. <laughs> yeah. You are looking good. Yeah, thanks, darling. You too. You look, you know, you look more like it. Thank <laughs> you. Oh, no, yes, mom. Where are you coming from? Oh, where I'm coming from? Uh, I'm so sorry. I actually went... Um, out with my friends, we could not make it yesterday. I'm sorry from the heart. Welcome. Thanks a whole lot, Mom. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> yeah. Can I get the things I sent you to buy for me from the market? Huh? That is huh? The things you saw should get for you from the. Huh? Oh, no, no. Where is the thirty thousand naira I gave you? Thirty thousand naira. No, hundred thousand. Hey, hey, Mom, I'm sorry. 30k. I'm sorry, Mom. Oh, my God. Mom, I could not remember you were the one that, you know, gave the money to me. I'm so sorry, and I've used it. You must be out of your mind. Ononeni, if you don't give me that money today, you will not like what I will do to you. Mom, please, please. You're welcome to give me my 30,000 naira. You're not saying anything. Ugodi, what do you want me to say? Is he not your son? You want to drag me into this matter, isn't it? Listen, I have a lot of things in my mind and I don't want distraction from anybody. Mom, is it because of ordinary 30k you want to bring down the roof of this house? Huh? 30,000. 30,000. That's what you're shouting. It's okay. Mom, I will give you back your 30k. Okay? Okay, no, I will. Give me the money. Huh? Give me the money. Bring 30k. That, see. Mom, stop this thing. Now, you see what Mom is doing? Please, I'm scared. Mom, you should be insulting me in this house. Do I look like a kid? Mom, I don't like this. Give me my 10,000 now. Bring that money now. Please, I don't like this. Give me my 10,000 now. 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 What did I do wrong to them? What did I do wrong to them? Huh? Ha! Hey. <clears throat> <laughs> so, how is business? Ah, fine though. We thank God for everything. My guy, three months ago, I acquired two more trucks for the business. And any moment from now, more will be coming. Chica! 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 Chica, go and pack those clothes. Go and pack them. Don't let that your filthy hand touch me. Don't let it touch oh, me. You are just looking for trouble. What's wrong with you? Huh? Baby. Norma will not just let me be in this house. She won't leave me alone. Obi, I told her to Shut back up. Get you on. Why are you this wicked? I've told you to be careful with Cheka because of her condition. Yet you're quarreling with her every time. Listen, 
if anything happens to her pregnancy, Norma, if anything happens to her pregnancy, I'll take you up for it. Robin, why are you treating me like this? Mm -hmm. You've never for once listened to me each time I have issues with Chika. You heard me. Now please don't argue with me. I'm not arguing with you, my husband. Well, please tell Chika to stop abusing me because she thinks she's pregnant and I'm not. Have you seen it? Have you seen it? So you're jealous of me? Okay. So this is what has been eating you up, eating you in this house lately, eh? Am I responsible for your infertility? Am I? I am not happy with the way you treated that issue between Norma and Jake. They are your wives and should have equal rights in your house. Johnny, Norma has become troublesome. She's fond of causing trouble every time in my house. I don't think so. From my observation, you're biased against the Norma because of her condition. Tony, are you the one to tell me what is going on in my house? I just told you what is going on in my house, that Norma has become troublesome. And you're saying another thing. Look, she's angry with Chica because she's pregnant. Simple. It's not true. Anyways, come to think of it, Obiora. Is it not the same Norma you are so fond of in the past? Get to say. Look, forget about the past. If Norma cannot raise children, she should give peace to others who can. Uh, look, a pregnant woman needs a peaceful atmosphere to deliver safely. Uh, uh, and Norma is not living up to that. And I don't like it. My man, no is not that way.
Mama, she has been so unhappy in this house since she discovered that my husband no longer supports her anymore. <laughs> mm -hmm. Sister, you really have to be very careful. Mm, you have to be very careful, like your sister said. But my dear, as far as I am concerned, you are the only wife Obiora has. Mm -hmm. A woman is useless in her husband's house. If she cannot bear children, 10 years and we are still counting. No, now. Hi, Mbano. Mama, in our first one, she's not a woman at all. Ha. I know. I know. Ne Relax and rejoice, for the favor of God is upon you. Amen, oh, Mama. <laughs> Don't you ever greet me again, you know? I came here to warn you to stay away from my child. If you are tired of staying here without a child, imagine like it, go to your father's house. Hey, 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 and you heard what my mother said because the next time I get a report that you harass my other sister, ha, I, Angelica, will come here and personally beat you up. Correct. Shameless Baruma. Woo! 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 A woman is not a woman if she cannot bear children for her husband. Bam. Ten years and it is still counting. I'm a bit
trust only in God. Only God will not betray you. Oh, don't put your trust in man because a man will surely betray you. Some people will destroy what someone else has built. They will reap where they did not sow. Such is the world. The trust in them. Moss, please, please. This is taking too long. Has my wife put to bed? Calm down, sir. Your wife is all right. What is happening? Has my wife put to bed? Yes, I wife get better, baby boy. Doctor, is there anything the matter? I'm sorry, Mr. Biola. You baby didn't survive. What are you telling me? He died due to prolonged labor. But Wait. You killed my child. You threatened you will kill my child. Now you have achieved it. What are you talking about? Did you not threaten that you would kill my child? Have you not done it? Haven't you? Calm down. It's not the time to talk about that. But while in law, this is the right time to talk about it. If she truly threatened to kill my daughter's child, that means she's answerable to the death of that. Ever since Chika and her mother came back from the hospital, they've been accusing me of being responsible for her baby's death. I've been expecting my husband to caution them, but he hasn't done anything about it. Mama, why should I kill an innocent child? <laughs> Norma, Chelo, is this the reason you brought me out here? Eh? Mama, hey, don't mama me. Mama, why shouldn't Chika accuse you of killing her baby? Eh? Ever since she stepped into this house, you have never been in good terms with her. Eh? I had everything that happened in the past from the village. I'm not even in the men. Mama. Anything anybody told you about me is not true. Mm -hmm. They lied. Mm -hmm. Remember, I was the one who recommended Cheka to my husband because she's my friend. Hey, because you did about Mama. Listen very carefully. Mm -hmm. I, Bridget, cannot allow you to ruin my son's life. You know what I mean? If you are tired of staying here, go back to your wretched parents. Allow my son to enjoy his new wife. Allow him to enjoy his new wife, Norma. Okay, lady. If you need help, Norma, allow him. Oh, yes. Yes. I want 
to see you at the reservoir very early tomorrow morning. Oh, yes. My consignment is already on the way right now. Just monitor the offloading for me. I hope to be with you before 12 noon. Yes. Thank you very much. Um. Onani. Sir. What's the matter? Uh, Dad. The 250,000 error I told you about, I'll be using it tomorrow morning. It's all right. You have to see your mother. Huh? Yes. Okay. I've instructed her to give you the money. I gave her 400,000 naira. 250,000 naira for you. Wow. And 150,000 naira for your sister. I hope this money will keep you happy for quite some time. Of course, yes. Yeah, yeah. I'm so, I'm so, I'm so happy that. I'm oh, so happy. don't mention it. Thank you very much. It's my pleasure. Yeah, you're the best. Thank you. Uh, Mom! Mom! Oh, yes. I am greatly relieved. With five million liters each of petrol, diesel oil, cooking gas and kerosene, I hope to be a multi-billionaire in no distant time. I feel I am on top of the world. <laughs>
line, the front line. Obiora's first wife has a hand in the death of the second wife's baby. That was what I heard. I don't even know if it is true or not. Obiora's mother, Bridget, was even here yesterday to tell me about the death of the baby. Why is Obiora so unfortunate? My dear, I don't know. I don't know. Oh, God, dear. Sweetheart. Let me rush. They have started offloading the consignment. Okay. Daddy, I got some message from home. Thank you, sir. My daughter, you're welcome. I hope to see you when I come back. Okay. <laughs> Hello? Hello? Yes, I'm right on my way now. I will be with you in the next 10 minutes or thereabouts. <laughs> What? What? No! 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 What? Sweetheart, what? Honey! Honey, don't do this, please! Get up! What's this now? Get up! Honey, please! Get up! What is this now? Don't do this! So, uh, that's what I'm saying. I don't care about what Samson said. The most important thing is that uh, once I get there, yeah. they're going to understand that Onuni has arrived. <laughs> that's my baby. No, that's it. <laughs> and I'm going to conquer. You get it? Yeah. Yeah, conquer, baby. Ah, what's all this now? Who's, who's calling? <laughs> mom. Mom's here. Why is my mom disturbing me now? Maybe you never can tell. Maybe she's worried about your whereabouts, something. Worried about my whereabouts? Mm -hmm. Listen, I don't care about nothing. All I care about right now is my enjoyment. I just want to enjoy myself. Enjoyment, boy. Oh, yeah. what, what, what else do you expect me to do? <laughs> if not to enjoy myself all the time, see? My dad has all the money. Do you understand? Yeah. So I am not bothered about nothing. I don't care about any shit in this world. Do you understand? Yeah. What's all this call on about now? Who's calling? Mom is still disturbing me. I should pick up. Mm -hmm. I should take mom's call. You know what? I'm going to take it because of you. Thank you. Hello, mom. Mom, please, I'm very busy. I'm so, so busy at the moment. Please, please. What? Hello? No, no, no. What happened to Dad? My, my, Dad? Okay. Huh? Hello? 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 Hello, Mom? Mom? Baby, what happened to Dad? She was actually trying to say something, but I, I, I could not get it. Okay, so no, 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 there's, there's a problem. No, no, let's, let's, we have to go. We have to run along. Okay, baby. Okay, let's go. Uh, uh, right. Bartender, come take your money. Come take your money. Hurry up.
We heard what happened. So we came to condole with your husband and his second wife. So it is true, eh? It's true. The baby died in her womb, according to them. Still dead? Hi! Too painful. Uh-uh. 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 Eh? So you, after killing the baby in my womb, you went to invite your parents to come here and mock me, eh? No. What is she talking about? What do you mean, what is she talking about? Did she not tell you how she killed the baby in my womb? Oh, both of you came here to make mockery of me, right? Chica, watch your tongue. I won't have you embarrass me in front of my parents. Did you hear that? What kind of accusation is that? Ah! It's not accusation. She did it. You, Bet. 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 You will surely pay for this, I promise you. You will surely pay. No. In your house. Why I came home to tell you what I've been passing through. Hmm. Obiora beat you up. Norma. 
ها؟ You see that? You see that? The very day you came and told me of your plan to bring Chika, your best friend, as Obiora's second wife, I knew that very soon you saw something we have. I knew! I knew! Papa, I never expected it from her. I never did. It is painful that you, Norma, has been going through hell in Obiora's hands all this while. And she to tell us. You did not tell us. Norma, let me tell you one thing. You must be very patient. Everything will come to normal. Hmm? But one thing is that you must be very careful with what you eat in the house. Possibly Chica can poison your food. Mom, she can do that. Papa, Again. It's possible. Yes. She's my daughter. But whatever, nobody will take your right in that house. As Obiora's first wife, nobody is going to take away your right. Wow. Oh. It's very painful that Obiora of all people should forget all that Norma went through in that house at the beginning. How can he forget so soon? My, that is meant for you. Mama, this is not about or that is meant. Obiora is Obiora. Papa is, Papa is different. Papa is not with that. In law, it is said that a stitch in time saves nine. So I would like you to send word across to your to your son and tell him what I said. Now you can Are you telling me that your daughter Norma came all the way from the city to complain to you that my son is treating her bad? Um that is not the point. That is not the point. Then what is the issue here? Eh? You people have not been happy with my son since he took Chika as his second wife. Manache, what I'm doing? Is he the cause of Norma's problem? Eh? Is he the reason why Norma could not give him a child? Not even one. Come off him, Boro. Uh, in law. You are talking another thing. I am just saying another thing. I believe I have not said anything about first or second wife issues since we started talking. So I don't understand what you are talking. Then what are you talking about? What I am talk talking about is that your son Obiora should treat my daughter Norma well in his house. Her rights should not be denied her in that family. That is what I am saying. Nike is again to come work. You failed to give your daughter a proper home training. Huh? That is why she has been having this problem in her husband's house. Huh? Please, don't come here to disturb me again. Biko, you really happen? Bridget, or if you could be done. Uh, if you could be done. has forgotten what Norma went through in this house in the past. God, I know you are watching. Nani ya jomo na jomad we ye juru nuwa. Ekana? No. Where is Ekana? Come, 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 come. Mama, like, you give you everything you have in your Of course I should. You brought a lot for us. I have to give something in return. Oh. You see this, Ubu? Very fresh. 
When you get to the house, use it as a prepared vegetable soup. I know you will like it. Oh, thank you, Mama. Thank you so much. <laughs> no, no. You pay all with this cost. Eh? When you get to take things easy. Oh? Very soon, everything will be alright. Amen. One day it shall be your turn. Oh, yeah. thank so, you, Mama. Mom, don't be messy. Don't take care of yourself. I will, I will. <laughs> I will take care of yourself. Receiver. 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 Receiver.
you are in trouble. Hey, I overheard you answering a call this evening. You said something about buying some houses. Yeah. I was discussing with my lawyer. A friend of mine told me about some properties that I would save by a bank. So I called my lawyer to tell him he's going to come to me tomorrow. So you want to buy them? I'm interested in the prices are very attractive. <laughs> you can go with me. I'm I'm sorry. I'm sorry, please. What is the problem? Every time I take a look at you, I wonder what you take me for. I've been noticing what's been going on in this house since you returned from the village. And what is that supposed to be? No, ma. I am not a fool. You can go ahead and do whatever it is you're doing to turn Obiora's mind away from me. But I'll promise you, it can never work. It seems you don't know the family I come from. Please, Jake. I'm not afraid of you. Just hear me to find out whatever evil you plan against me will turn back to you. All right. Let's watch it. Obiora gives her more attention than I. Maybe this is the reason she traveled to the village. I have a feeling that she returned with some juju that she uses to remote him. Mama, I'm worried. I was seriously worried. That's why I called that you come. Well, uh, Chica, just calm down. Hmm? Norma's days in this house are numbered. Just calm down. But Mama, she has been sleeping in his room for some days. He doesn't even care whether I exist or not. Huh? Hmm? Welcome, ma. Eh, eh. Chide, ma. Eh, wam. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Eh, eh. Hmm. 
did I not tell you to calm down? Eh? Just calm down. I will let Norma know that I know this game more than she does. Man, you just have to do something really fast. You have to do something. I'm worried. Calm down now. Eh? Leave everything to me. Oh? Uh, 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 have you people cooked? Mm. Okay. You see a moment. I think Amara is right. We cannot realize enough money by selling that car. Eh? Nemo, see here. We still have one house left in this city. After bank auctioned the other ones yesterday. Eh, mommy? And what I'm just suggesting is that let's just sell it, you know, and raise enough money for ourselves. No, I need cash. And the full house, we need cash in this house. Look at, look, just look at Amara. Eh? Look, look at the kind of cheap hair she's wearing. Eh? Nemo, look at you. Why, your man? Look at your color. You're not dark enough. You know? eh? eh? So what I'm saying is let's just, you know, sell it and, you know, raise money for ourselves, you know, for our upkeep and all that. Eh? Please. Mommy, please now. My agent has a buyer standing by. Please. Can the person pay by next week? All I need to do is to call him on the phone. It's okay. You can invite him so we discuss in details. Huh. <laughs> Mom, you are the best. You see the reason I said you are the very best? Eh? Nemo, yesterday night when I was sleeping, I actually asked myself, what do I do with that, my sweet mommy? Eh? Mom, thank you so much. Uh, I mean, please call this man immediately. Call him. Yes. Okay. Let me ping him. Oh, you want to ping him? Yeah. Go ahead. Uh, mommy, when I was going to um, um, Zeke's Plaza yesterday, there was this guy I saw. Mom, this guy is, is dope, man. It's something else, man. See, him. when this money comes, man, when this whole transaction falls into place, I'll buy the car. Oh no, Nenji. Wait until the agent comes. It's gonna come. It's gonna come. Uh, Ami. Yeah. Have you sent in the message? Yet? Um, I'm almost done. Please do, 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 do. Huh? Do. Ah, last one is coming. Hey, 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 hey. Hey, hey, hey. Hey, hey. When did you come back from Nigeria? I came in three days ago. Three days ago. Yes. Wow. You're welcome. Thank God for Johnny Messi. Oh, thank God for Johnny Messi. You know, I'm just coming from the bank. Okay. We've completed all the processes involved. I am the rightful owner of those properties now. <laughs> I am the rightful owner of those properties. Odogu! Odogu! Is it me? You see, Obiora, I'm so proud of you. Oh, what you doing? Eh? I like the way you do your things. You know, My brother, eh? mm? congratulations. Thank you. Congratulations. Thank you. Thank you. Yes. Thank, you. Thank you. Thank you. Tony, do you remember that my uncle I told you about in the past? The one that is late now. Sure. Okay. He was the owner of those oil and gas stations that I bought. I'm telling you, he used them as collateral before he died. So the bank confiscated the properties when the family could not service the loan and the interest it has accumulated. Are you telling me the truth? I couldn't believe it myself when I saw his names on the documents the bank presented to me. Hey! Couldn't believe it. What a surprise. What a world. When were we see you? When were we see I nearly changed my mind when I saw his names. But I considered two things. One, because I'm a businessman, the prizes we are very attractive, I must confess. Two, if I had failed to buy them, outsiders would go for them. Which is a good decision. Yes, at least, you know, at least the properties are still within the family. <sighs> but my brother, 
these are the same people that I was begging to help me for food. This is serious. And they refused. Just look at that. Ifugo. Hey! Anyways, um, congratulations, my brother. You know, you know the wealth of the weekend is laid down for the job. <laughs> Is that all? Yes. <laughs> My father was able to cage the wind. Hmm. So caging a mere mortal is not a challenge. <laughs> Take this. It kills instantly. Tell her to be careful with it. I'll tell her. Oh, the legion now. Oh, the legion. I got me to work him. It's a man, your sanga, Kisama Kasanga. You can go. Thank you. The world we're living is a world of tears. The world we're living is a world of pain and deceit and betrayal. Oh, the person you trust so much can be the one to betray you. Oh, the one that's closest to you can be the one to break your heart. Ah, trust only in God, the only God. Baby. Yes, my dear. I spoke with Mama in the afternoon. She said she's been trying to reach you on phone, but you weren't picking up. Oh, yes. She said she wanted to tell you something. Did she drop the message with you? Yes, she did. Mama said uh, Norman's father came to the house some days ago and said so many bad things about you. According to Mama, she said Norman's father said, Norma said you have been maltreating her. Me? Norma said that? If Mama said Norma said that, then it's true. So Mama called so you cautioned her. Where's Norma now? Um, I think she's in the living room. Uh, really? The charm is working. Let me see how he will handle this. Norma! What did you tell your parents the last time you wrote to me? Say 
know I'll kill you. New jet. Yes, I got it. That's it. That's my new jet. <laughs> yeah, just have a look at it. Just look around, look around, look around my new jet. Yeah. <laughs> wow. Mom, I got it. This is good. Cool. <laughs> Come here, give me a hug. Thanks, Mom. Thank you so much. Uh, you know you've good. got it. <laughs> of course I do. Walk around. Sometimes I can have this kind of food around town. Yes, Your woman loves good things. Of course, you know. of course, it's for the food family. Sweet, sweet, sweet. Of course. I know you like it. <laughs> I bought it for myself, my mother, and my kid sisters. Well. <laughs> so, um, the thing is, this car you see, guess how much I bought it? Mama, mm -hmm. you needed to see the way my husband beats, beats, beats her up mercilessly. <laughs> this is just the beginning. <laughs> By the time I am through with her, she will know the trouble she has gotten herself into. Mama, you don't even understand. I hate that girl. I hate her. I hate everything about her. Even the steps that she makes, I hate it. No, just calm down. Oh, that is why I am here. I trust you now, Mama. Yeah. <laughs> so, Mama, how are we going to go about it? I went to Agaba, the native doctor in our village. Okay. And, uh, and he gave me this. What is this? It is poison. 
matter. He said it kills instantly. Correct. That you should just drop a little quantity inside your husband's food and that is it. Hmm? Inside whose food? Your husband's food. Miko, Mama, where, where? My husband. Mba. Mama, you want me to poison my husband? Please, please, please tell him to find another plan. Hey, Chica, calm down and listen Mama, to me Biko, first. Mama, I don't want to calm down. How can you ask me to poison my husband? Achoro, Mbiko. Mba. Ha. Poison my husband. Ha. Kill my husband. Kwa. Is not tired of cruising around. Hmm. My daughter, it's not his fault. He's privileged. Let him enjoy himself. Your brother. Hello. Who are you and what are you doing with my son's phone? What? He's involved in an accident. Where? Which hospital? Please, I'm coming there immediately. It's your what? brother. He's involved in an accident. Accident. I'm going to the hospital. If you're coming with me, go to my bedroom, get my hand back.
I don't want you to do this. I don't intend to become a woman. Yet. Pardon me. The food has been poisoned. What? Why? My heart. <gasps> she poisoned the food. I saw it. She was doing it. Virginia. What did I just hear you say? Norma, is it true? Well, yeah, I don't know what she's talking about. Nah! Why don't you just go ahead and tell the truth? I saw you! Chica, if this is a joke, I'm not finding it funny. Stop it! This is a joke? Seriously, this is a joke! Good. If you are innocent as you insist, then go ahead and taste this food. I will not taste that food because I don't know what you've planned. Norma, taste this food. Chica should go first. Alright, alright, fine. This does not call for any argument. Let's give some grains from here to the farm. If it leaves, then I'm lying. And if it doesn't... <laughs> Norma, I'm asking you for the last time. Did you poison this food? I don't even know what she's talking about. Eh? How can I poison your own food? Okay. What? Jesus! Mama, help him. You wanted to kill me? No, help him. You have seen it, though. You have seen it, baby. Chimo, you have seen it. You wanted to kill me? It's the lie. Take her. Take her. What? Hey! Jesus! You wanted to kill me, eh? No! But it is the lie. I didn't do it. Hey! I did it. Come on, 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 come on,
My daughter rejoice, so you have won this battle. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> oh, really? Oh, <laughs> oh, eh? welcome. Thank you. Oh. You're welcome. When did you come? A few minutes ago. Has she told you how that idiot wanted to kill me this morning? My in-law, she told me. Hmm? Devil is a liar. Amen. Hi. Wait, not for Chica. I would have been a dead man by now. Fear what? Can you be honest? They will never succeed. Amen. Um, uh, please, let me get something from my room. I'm rushing back to the office immediately. Okay, all okay. right. Mm -hmm. Hi, people are wicked. I've seen how wicked Obiora is to you, me, and this entire family. Chica will suffer! Chica will never see anything good in her life! Don't Chica will suffer! Don't bother. Hey! God is the rightful judge. God will judge her. Hmm? Don't bother yourself. It's okay. It's okay. Yeah? But hey! But this is not the first. This is not the second. This is not the third. No. What? What's happening now? What confuses me in the entire set of is this? How can Obiora believe such an accusation? That's just the point. How can he believe that my daughter can do such a thing? What does she stand to gain? Obiora has disappointed me. Great disappointment. Honestly, this guy disappointed me totally. I can't believe this. I need to be okay. I need to be. Oh, okay. Hey. Go to my room and bring me my snuff box. Ah, it's okay. Stop crying. Stop crying. Stop crying. <laughs> it's not the first time. It's not the second time. It's not the third time. <laughs> So, are you here to tell me what your son told you or to learn the truth? Which truth? That Chica framed my daughter up. Hey! No, ma. Hey! No, me not see you, Was it what you told them? Ha! Why can't you tell them the simple truth, no, ma? Truth? Eh? Hey, no, ma. That is the reason you do not give my son a child. Bridget, enough of that insult. Stop it! Huh? It's enough. Please, leave. Mama, go! Leave. leave. I say leave. You know, in the name of progress. Go, 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 go away. You will soon die a wretched guy. Fight to center. You know what I mean? Fight to center. You all want my son to die so that you will inherit his property. Eh? Mama, my alone. Calm down, 
Yeah. But as for you, Norma, you will suffer for it. But to say that, he can fix But to say that, you useless woman. I can't you hold suffering. They are only hold your need and move on. Back to center, you will see. Go and talk to your son. Let me see you here again. I thought as a mother-in-law or a grandmother that you are, you will make peace. Just come here to insult your son. Because of you. Back to center. We are not here to make trouble with anybody. My lord, please, I'm here to beg you to calm down. Please, people. Calm down? Yes. After your daughter attempted to kill me? Is it because I did not involve the police? That is not what I mean. You know, my law, you know you needed more time to investigate this matter. Hmm? Because I know that my daughter has no reason at all to try to poison you. Hmm? Please, I want peace to reign. Please. Mr. Kenze. I'm disappointed. Your daughter poisoned my food. And all you could say is that I should conduct an investigation before sending her away. I'm sorry. It's over between Norma and I. Huh? Hey, my lord, please don't say that. Please, don't say that. Well, you can leave whenever you want to. I'm done with you. My My Human beings are not worthy to be trusted. How could I believe that my own Obiora will let her change? It is unbelievable. I can't help crying each time I remember the past. Mama, um, to be very honest with you, I'm tired of this mechanic work. I think I should be thinking of something else to do. I've told you to be patient. Hmm? Things will soon get better. Let's just be managing until God decides to bless us. You don't understand. It has been from one problem to the other. Is it that one customer is owing me or another one is complaining that the work I did for him is not good? I've been having problems with most of the customers I work for. It's okay. Huh? It's the, okay. The consequence is that the majority of them are not patronizing me anymore. Something is wrong with me. I have to accept it. Look at my mother. My mother has been sick since. I cannot buy drugs for her. I cannot even take her to the hospital. Something is wrong with me. Something is wrong somewhere. Nothing is wrong with you. Huh? Obim, there is nothing wrong with you. Huh? All these things will soon be over. I'm here to support you build a better family. Huh? very hard and I know that God will soon heal you. Mm -hmm. Obim, let's take her to the hospital. Her condition is getting worse every day. No. How can you be talking as if you don't know the situation here? The problem is that I don't have any money in this house. Let's go and see your uncle or Sophia. He just came back from the city yesterday. Mm -hmm. Sophia? My uncle, Oswafia, I will never see that man for any assistance again. Never. How can I have such a man? And I'm in this village suffering like this. Mm -hmm. We are talking about life here. Eh? 
We can't continue to watch Mama like this. <laughs> Fine. I'll go with you and see him. Please, my son. Why can't you go and see your uncle? <laughs> sorry, sorry. Man. He might be of help. Because now I'm without. <laughs> Please come in, the door is open. Ah, you are welcome. Nama, I'm happy to see you. Please sit down and make yourselves comfortable. Uncle, how is the new one? All right. Uh, well, I need to get rid of these tubs. Um, I want to dispose them of the wastebasket outside. Um, which means you have to hurry and get to the market immediately to get new ones. I'll give you 30,000 naira so that you use it to buy other things we need in the house. All right, Dad. All right. Uh -huh. Obi, your mother. Uncle, as I'm talking to you now, my mother is seriously ill. Have you taken her to the hospital? No, sir. Why? What are you waiting for? Money. Money. Uncle, there is no money. Please, help me with some money so that I can take my mother to the hospital. Please. I heard what you said. Thank you. I am sorry I don't have any money now. As you can see, things are getting tougher and tougher these days. Eh? But I want you to make some effort. I want you to go out there, look for money, so that you see if you raise enough money to take your mother to the hospital. So that you give her the desired treatment she rightly deserves. That is what it is. Huh? Thank you, sir. It's well, huh? Pull yourself together. Send my regards to her, alright? I told you I didn't want to come here in the first place. Eh? Can you imagine my uncle saying that things are hard for him? Only the way we do her, things are hard for him. Somebody that built this kind of thing, things are hard for him. Please, take it easy. Eh? Let's go home and think of what next to do. Biko. Huh? Obin Biko. Hey, what are you doing there? What are you doing with those things? I want to go with them. Do you want to kill yourself? Huh? Those things are expired. Huh. The expiry date is just two days ago. As soon as it has expired. Now lie. This is not harmful. Rima, are you sure? Am I sure? Now we are near killing me.
take your tea so that you can take the drugs I bought for you. No, my God. See, if I take the tea, I'll vomit it. Unga boy. I'll try. Huh? Pick one. Mama. Please, sir. This tea is a good one. You won't vomit it. So that there will be something in your stomach before you take the drug. Please. We never go warm. Oh, Governor, I work for you. Shame I don't beg you. Just give us the key. Don't we come back? We go give you. Touch me again. Give look. Hey, look. Give me that key. Give me. Wait. Give me that key. Stand up. Stand up. Stand up. Stand up. Stand up.
money. They took my money and beat me on top of it. God will punish them. Well, you shouldn't have fought them no matter what, eh? I keep telling you this. Now, they still took the key and didn't pay you. They, they were many. I would have dealt with them. Ozu, Ozu, sorry. Hey! Hey! Open your hand, Mama! Okay! What happened to him? He fought with a bus driver and his conductor this afternoon. Hey! Chineke, na mobi or again, kwa no no. Eh? Mama. Nikoji? They took my money and beat me on top of it. Hey! Chineke, na mobi. They were with me. All I do. Bia, na go di urugi. Eh? Nini ha me gini ni? Just look at yourself. Eh? Hey! Chineke. Nene. Let me help you. Oh. Hey! 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 I have to start with you. You Thank you. Mm -hmm. I'll come and see you tomorrow when I come back from the market. Okay, no problem. Uh, take good care of him. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Uh, thank you, Chica. No problem. Ndo o, sorry. It is well. Thank you. 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 Are you leaving? Yes, let me go now and come back on time. Okay, it's your mama. Oh, oh, mama. Oh, mama. Please make sure he eats his food before he takes the drugs. <laughs> as, in, as in, I'm a little boy. <laughs> there is no problem. Oh, thank you, mama. One half your mama. Oh, one mama. Oh. Such a good daughter in law. So humble and very hard working. God will bless her one day with a baby. Yes. God will bless her with a baby. Mm. Mm. I come and eat your food, though. Oh. Why? You want to eat it? Oh, why you come now, we're ready. So give up with you, we're Good afternoon. Good afternoon. How are you? I'm fine. I'm fine. How is your husband? He's fine. Hope he's getting better. My dear, he's getting better. Oh, nice. Greet him for me when you get home. I will. Thank you. How do you feel? What's Ah, a fufu. Wow. She has been the one feeding her husband and her mother-in-law since she came to that house. And no woman in this village is as hardworking as she is. I wish she's my brother's wife. Uh, Mama, how is your husband? Hmm. Papa, he has fully recovered. Though. Amen! <laughs> hey, he's supposed to start work today after spending three weeks at home. Hallelujah. God is able. Papa, the doctor said that my husband is very lucky that the injury did not affect his bone. Uh -huh. You see it? Hey, Amen. Uh -huh. uh, I spent so much in that hospital. I know. I spent so much. So I just asked you for just 2,000 I couldn't give to me. Shut up. Uh -huh. <laughs> Every time receiving, receiving. Can't you give somebody for once? Hey, on the no, don't worry. I know that very soon everything will be all right. Amen. Mother, digide na ni wan bwenta. Everything. Yes. Mother, digide. Oma, chai. You're welcome. I'm a mike boy. Oma, mother, digide na ni wan bwenta. No, no, ma. Get your daughter something to eat. Obro ni yuku yenon nonda na. 
Move now and get the food. Now you don't need to teach me my job. Ah. I know what to do. Oh, Mama, please don't bother yourself. Eh? I don't feel like eating anything. You don't want to eat anything? I'm, I'm not hungry. But let me tell you one thing. Oh, we home bossy there no to an hour. Oh, you can give me a job. Okay. Hey, <laughs> Mama, what does that mean? Meaning we are farmers in the village. Yes. Any moment you enter into this house, I will get you things to go back with. Hey. Things like a butter. Hey. Apple. Hey. Two bars of yam. Hey. 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 Manu. And Ogiribu. Mama, be But for you to see it now, let me go and get you some. Hey, ne mama. Hey. Oh. Um, um, Ekene, Papa. go to the barn and get uh, three tubers of yam for your sister. Quickly. Mm -hmm. nah, Papa, life is not easy. Uh, hey. Are you telling me? Hey. Yeah, oh, hey. oh, oh, this is Upaka. And this is Ogiri. Mm. Yes, to prepare the abacha for you. Mm. Mm. I don't want to miss it. The when you see, I prepared it myself. Ah. Mama, oh, you know, thank you so much. <laughs> my daughter, it's well. It's well. All you owe me is that whenever you want to come, just tell me. Tell me, I'll get this. Hey, hey, I'm so happy to have you. Get the rope. Tie the tie the yams. Tie them together. Hey, oh, oh. thank you so just much. Just one is one. Don't mention oh, it. Please. You wonder what I'll do. Now, that's the God is there for us. All is well. Say it well. Right. Twist his face from here to there. His name is Kenenoto Biora. Right. Whoever did this will never go unpunished. God will expose him or her. Eh? Why? Hey! You want to get a name? Why? 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 Oh, hey, oh, children. Hey, hey, they have stolen your husband's tomb. Eh? Hey, it's all I'm going to watch. How did it happen? Eh? I went to where I normally keep my toolbox only to discover that they have stolen my toolbox. Hey! Chimo! Hey! Chimo! Why now? Chimo! Chimo! Why now hey. that I'm just fully recovering from this beating? What is this? Hey! Get it for! Get it for! No, ma. No, ma, it's okay. Hey, it's okay. Stop crying, Pano. Mama, please do this. If you don't want trouble, if you don't want trouble. Hey, Timo. Stop crying. It's okay. It's okay. Oh, God. I love how much I spent. To buy this two box. You have suffered a lot in this our poor condition. The only means through which I assist you in this house has vanished into thin air. It gives me sleepless nights. God will expose those criminals. Amen. Baby, wipe your tears, huh? <laughs> I want you to understand that the downfall of a man is not the end of his life. Oma, this my downfall may just be the end for me. God forbid. But I don't have hope. 
when there is no hope, life is not worth living. And a man that does not have hope is as good as dead. God. Yeah, it's not true. There is nothing God cannot do. I want you to take this as a challenge. I believe God will surely make a way where there is no way. It's okay. Hmm? The one that breaks my heart is my uncle's attitude. Why does he not want to help me? He has money. Why can't he help my family? Your uncle also is a very wicked man. A room. I knew he wouldn't listen to you. But it's well. Hmm? Obi, I'm coming. This is my savings since I came into your house. I wanted to use part of it and start up a small business for my mom. How much is the toolbox? Oh, you know, things are very expensive now. If you want to get a complete toolbox, Zulay's, it will not be less than 30,000 now. Take it and break it. Then take it. Break it. Oh, 
Ano ta mesmo ano? Chica, my dear, it's not easy. <clears throat> I thank God he has gone to purchase another toolbox. Wait, oh. are you saying you broke your safe box and gave your husband all the money inside it? I did. Hmm? I can't keep such money while he goes about begging for help. Didn't I tell you that he went to see his uncle the other day? Eh, uh, you told me. I'm not saying what you did is bad, though. But anyway, Sha, I'm happy for you. I'm happy. <laughs> I keep begging God to change his condition. So that it could ease the stress and passing through. It's all right. Oh, it's all right, Nene. Don't lose hope. Let me check uh, if the food is done so that we can eat. Uh, no, I can't wait. So. Ah, have you forgotten? I told you I was going somewhere now. Don't oh, worry, the orange is okay. It's okay. Let me carry one extra. Hey! <laughs> Stand, uh, let's go. <laughs> You have been here since this morning. How long are you going to continue like this? Eh, Norma? Crying all day? If I had not given him that money that I wanted to use to open a shop for you, he wouldn't have gone back to that business that changed his life. I wonder what is wrong with this car. No, it's okay. Just go and try it again. Okay. Okay. That's good, that's good, that's good, that's good, that's good. Uh, ah, he knows it. Yes, yes. Uh, that's good, yeah, it's that's okay good. Now. I've rectified the problem. Oh, that's good. Wonderful, wonderful, wonderful. How much is your money? Um, okay, just bring 2,000 naira. Ah, is it not too much? Hi, <laughs> Oga. The work I did in this car is worth 4,000 naira. But for customer's sake, that's why I say you should bring 2,000. Right. No problem, no problem. It's okay.
Where is that stupid man? Mr. Man, so you are here eating? When my car has fallen over there, the car you fit for me. Eh? What's the problem, sir? You are very stupid man. You are an idiot. For asking me that question. Hey! Imagine. Look at the car you fit for me. It's fallen over there. I pity whoever is your wife. You are a very lazy man. Please, dog, please calm down. This man is a very lazy man. You are an idiot. He's a very stupid man. Somebody like you cannot feed your family. Eh? Look at. I give you 30 minutes to go and fix that car now. Otherwise, I'll lock you up in the police cell. Oh, stupid man. Oga. Oga. Oh. 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 Please come fix the car. Oh. Pico. Come fix it, please. You know, Ribe, Ribe, go. Eh? Why <laughs> Hello. I've been calling you since morning and you refuse to pick my calls. Eh? You asked me to come to your village for my money on getting to your house and you ran away. I'm going to deal with you if I don't see my money before the end of the day. Nonsense. Idiot. Manichi <laughs> Mr. Man, are you sure the car is okay? Yes, it's okay. You are very sure? It was just one of the blood head that removed his head. Thank you, God. Thank you, God. Thank you. We're living is a world of tears. The world we're living is a world of pain and deceit and betrayal. Oh, the person you trust so much can be the one to betray you. Oh, the one that's closest to you can be the one to break your heart. Ah. Trust only in God. Only God will not betray you. Oh, don't put your trust in man, because a man will surely betray you. Some people will destroy what someone else has. Let him built. come back here tomorrow again to try this nonsense. I will deal with him. I respected him today because he's my customer. Look at what I found on the ground over there. Let me see. That's one. Direct manner from heaven, and you're talking. I don't want to know who owns it. Hey, yeah, we're here to go there. I don't know what's in here. I am not doing with it. 
Oh, give me. Dollars. That's real money. I'm going to the bank tomorrow to change it. Who be? Mama, look at this. Davidson. That is that man that dealt with me in my workshop. This is my reward for what he did to me. Hi. Thank God. Oh, No. We can't keep this money. Eh? We can't. Thank God he left his card inside this wallet. You have to call him tomorrow and return this money. What are you talking about? After what he did to me? Look, let me tell you. I am going to the bank tomorrow to change this money. Do you know the Naira equivalent of this money? Obi, please. Eh? You can't pay evil with evil. Two wrongs can make a right. If you do this, he will be ashamed of what he has done to you. Okay? Not in this case. I'm made of my mind. I have made up my mind on this. What you're talking does not apply in this case. You can think about it too. How can someone stay in the workshop from morning till evening without any work to do? The best thing is for me to quit this work. By the time I change those foreign currencies, there will be enough money for me to start another business. Yes, Please, did you see my wallet? Been looking for my wallet since yesterday. I didn't see any wallet. Are you sure I did not see any wallet? I didn't see any wallet. <sighs> Where could this thing be? Nani chineke, boni wariki tu kwa sobi. Nani chineke, ga kwa dogi yo. Uwani nani me ya umo wanya mili yo. Nani nina bea bota. Nina I'm disturbed about the wallet. Why are you worrying yourself over nothing? I thought we had concluded on that issue. Obi, I want you to return that wallet. Hmm? I know he treated you badly. But God won't be happy with us if we keep the wallet. Okay. Since you are this worried about that issue, I'll call him and return it. Now, can you allow mm. me to sleep? Mm -mm. I called him like three hours ago. I'm sure he'll be on his way now. Or if not, for you. 
when I remember what that man. Hey! No, ma. What are you doing here? This is my husband's workshop. And this is my husband. This is Obioso's son that stays in the city. Oh, welcome. <laughs> my pleasure, sir. Welcome. Wow, what a small world. I just drove in here to fix my car that has issues. I, I didn't know I was going to meet you. Oh, okay, your car has problems, yes. okay, oh you're welcome. <laughs> Hello, my friend. Where is the wallet? You a criminal! You a thief! Yeah. Eh? I came here before asking for this wallet. You said you did not see it. That makes you a criminal because you have been in possession of it. I made a mistake. This man is a criminal, he's a stupid man. It's not for my wife. I wouldn't have called you to give you that wallet. You are a thief! You are an ingrate! Sir, please, this is not how it happened. This man is a criminal. Make sure I don't have anything to do with him. Sir, it's okay. He has given you the wallet. It's okay. You see? You okay, see, you see you what you have done? done? Nonsense. Charles! This is what you've done. This is what you cost. This man is an ingrate. He doesn't deserve this. Can you imagine? I call him. Hey! Oh, uh, every day one drop. Actually, I was not comfortable the way this man handled that issue. That someone found a missing wallet doesn't make him a criminal. See the bear. That one is past. Get up and sit down first. What do you want me to do? It's about my husband. Uh, he's been complaining he wants to change his line of business because of the problems he has been experiencing. Thank God you witnessed the world the other day. It's okay. I understand everything you're passing through. My in-law, can you drive very well? Yes, I can do it. Okay. I have a friend in the city. He's into airport taxi. I'll call him this night so that he can fix you up. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Thank you. God bless you. What? He doesn't know anyone in the city. I wonder how you cope with the work. Don't worry about that. In fact, both of you should get ready. In the next three days, we are going to the city. Hey! <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Oma, mm -hmm. so in the next three days, we will leave the village for the city. <laughs> this is unbelievable. Hmm. I am the happiest human being on earth now. I know. Hi. It's written all over you. Hi. 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 Oma, I am grateful to God for giving me a good wife like you. Now I understand why the Bible says that he that findeth a wife findeth a good thing and obtaineth favor from the Lord. This unimaginable favor wouldn't have come my way if not because of him. Oh mama, you are a blessing to me and my family. God will keep you from me no matter what happens. I'm grateful to God that I found you. Thank God for everything. I hope the Mumani Pikagi Chai Namamo Ibuapuriche Onemje Monuo 
Ana make ne kio Njuku gozi yegi Onondom aga adiki detwa Driver please can you go faster than this? I'm almost late to the airport I need to catch up with the flight I can make cookie kawa In your money literal no, my no, my I made more money today than yesterday. Hey. Thank God. Hey. He will continue to do it for us. Amen. Amen. Mm -hmm. I can't stop thanking God for giving me here. It's your support for me that brought me from the village to the city. Okay. I'm grateful. Grateful. <laughs> we should be grateful to God. He made it possible. Yes, but God used you to bring it to reality. <laughs> yeah. you know, you know, now I know that thing they used to say, that behind every successful man, a good woman. Mm. You are that good woman. <laughs> and you know what? What? I will love you forever. Hmm. Nothing shall separate me from the love of my wife. Oh. <laughs> 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 I got images of I I I I I I Hello, sir. Good afternoon. Yes, I just arrived the country now. I was delayed because my convoy couldn't get to the airport on time. Yeah, I'm going home now in a taxi. Yes, I will bring everything concerning the contract to your office tomorrow morning. Thank you very much, sir. Thank you. I can make cookie kawa in your money literal. I can give me regio. Neke ne dele kwano ki dele chineke onye mele kamugi onye mele ki bulu ne mo ngaku wachiki e maji puru maji mbapo na ye te ne mama e ay no ma no ma no ma I saw this inside my car when I came back from work. I don't know who left it there. Let's see what's inside. These documents are like government contracts. Who is this? Mm, mm, mm. There's one woman I drove in that car today. Mm. 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 Wow, could she have forgotten such an important document inside your car? Eh? It's the fault of our security man. They should have checked the car very well before they leave it. Hey! Hey! Dollars! Dollars again? Hi! 
this is God talking the second time. This is direct blessing from God. Hi! Now we are blessed. Hi! Obi, what are you doing? I'm packing them. Ah, but we can't keep it too. Shut up. Who oh, they give honey in the mouth and the person will spit it out? This was the way you deceived me the other time. And I took the bunny back to the man and the man started cursing me. Did I steal this? Oh, please calm down. Eh? Let's seek the face of the Lord. Let's just pray about it. Okay? Hmm. Hmm. Chioma, 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 did you think she's a minister? Minister for power and energy. <laughs> God, Chimu. what have I done that you are so good to me? Yeah. Hmm. Tell me what happened. Hey! Oh, oh, oh. When I got to her apartment, mm -hmm. some journalists were outside. So when I told the security man why I came, he mm -hmm. took me straight to her. And behold, she was in the company of our government. Our governor. Our own governor. Yes. Hey! They, we are discussing about the dam the government wants to build for our state. Hey. And this dam is to be funded by both the federal government and the state government. And those documents, we are for the project. Jesus is Lord. So the woman could not believe it when she saw her bag hey. and saw that everything is intact. Hey. including the dollars. Hey. Oh, what can you yeah. see? The woman wrote two million naira check immediately and gave to me. Look two at it. Two million naira check. Two million naira. Look at it. Two million naira. Two million naira. Two million naira. Two million naira. Hey! Tell me that. Hey! The governor looked at me and said, by tomorrow I should come to his office and he will give me a contract of hundred million naira. I have proven to be just one. I have proven to be just one. I have proven to be just one. Forgive me, you are talking about it. Some of the apartment. Jesus. Jesus. Not only that, though. The woman told him to make it 200 million naira. I know you have power and energy. Jesus. And the governor, obviously, they know I'm a taxi driver. So the promise they will give you give me seventy percent of funds. I won't lack capital to sign the contract. Or give me a medal, no, Jesus, Jesus. You know, journalists were there. The woman called them and granted them interview and told them how I saved her from embarrassment. They will be airing it throughout Nigeria this night. Hey! Throughout the whole Nigeria this night. We are millionaires. We are millionaires. Oh, 
I got my sorrow to one. I can make cookie come one. In your money, little. I can be married to you. Make a dinner, one again. Dinner, you make it. On a mere come movie, on a mere keep. I will reward you for all the good you've done for me. I've never seen a woman like you. I don't really know how to say this. Come on. Go ahead and say it. I'm listening. As I was preparing to come back from the village yesterday, my mother came to me with some elders. Mm -hmm. He raised the issue of our childlessness. She was of the opinion that you charmed me. And that is why I refused to marry a second wife that can be our children. Your mother said that? Yes. Can you imagine? So, what have you decided to do? But I can't decide anything on my own. You know, I want us to put our heads together to take a decision. Noma, you know how much I love you. But I am an only son. The pressure on me is unbearable. I suggest that you get somebody you can trust. Whom we can make my second wife to be a you. You didn't come back with it? No, the driver took it to the mechanic not long ago. Oh, okay. <laughs> 
Baby back like this. After all I suffered for him, Mama. Even my best friend. Even my best friend whom I trusted so much. Hey. Oh God. No, Ma, it's okay. It's okay. God is watching both of you. He's the one to judge you. Allow God to do the judgment. It's okay. Start today, cry till tomorrow, it will not solve the problem. And you know it. <laughs> no, ma. Ah. Oh. Why do you cry over somebody who doesn't care about you? You want to go? Huh? If you like, cry all day long. It will not settle the matter. It won't. Do you hear me? See. My daughter, no. what is it? Come, come. Papa, what do you expect me to do? Papa, what do you expect me to do? <laughs> hey. Mm. Mama, I perfectly understand how you feel. Do you hear me? I do. Mm. Oh? All I'm saying is that you don't have to kill yourself. Dry your tears, my daughter. Dry your tears. Dry them. Eh? The God we serve is going to fight this battle for you. Amen. Do you hear me? Amen. Oh? Thank you, Papa. It's okay. Clean your face. Clean your face, right? What's going on? What's going on, Mom? Go on.
You're two months pregnant? Mama, the doctor said I'm pregnant. You pregnant? Hey! God! He said I'm three months pregnant. Oh, wait. Hey! The God that answered by fire. Hey, Mama. Hey! Did you say three months? Hey! Yes, Papa. Three months pregnant. Eh? God, you're wonderful. God, you're powerful. Oh! Eh? I know it. I've been watching you since you complained that you're not feeling fine. I've been watching your breasts, the size of it, your shape, and everything. It wasn't like it was before. Oh, Biora must know about this. He woke up! Oh, we must tell him that. Hey! So, God decided that we would triumph over our enemies, eh? Don't we say that God, my daughter Barry. Come and see that she's three months pregnant. Oh, wait up. Eva will get you one. Also, now, yeah. Hey! hey! You see this rice? You're supposed to share up. Share up! You're pregnant. Yes. You're not the one that impregnated yourself. Mm. Eh? Oh, no. You see this rice? I'm going to cook it in a special way for you. Yes. I will add up many things. <laughs> Carrot will be there. <laughs> add vegetable, room will get your course. Send it to a tight. Hey! <laughs> 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 I am not only happy that you're pregnant again, <laughs> but also happy that you are living with your husband alone in this house. <laughs> Thank you, Mama. Thank Hi. you. <laughs> <laughs> I paid Agaba another visit on your behalf. Why? We cannot just fold our arms, else your husband might wake up one morning and ask Norma to come back. And I don't want that to happen. So what did Agaba say concerning that? <laughs> he said you should drop this inside this bathing water every morning. That way he, he will never talk about Norma again. Just like that. Just like that too. Oh. Yeah? Norma will be gone forever. <laughs> Mama, thank
and told me about his daughter's present condition. And uh, we decided to come and see him. Um, please, I don't want to go into a guest walk. If you can kindly hit the nail on the head. Obiora, my daughter Norma is three months pregnant for you. Three months pregnant for who? For you. <laughs> uh, well, to be straightforward to you people, it is not true. And it couldn't have ever been true. How can you prove to me that a woman that could not conceive for 10 years of our marriage suddenly got pregnant after she left our house? Obiora, Norma is pregnant for you. Three months. Um, Obiora, I have not come to beg you to take back my daughter. But I have come to remind you that it is your responsibility to cater for her until delivery and after. Bam! Eh? Bam! Where's your cool? Um. Nani Kenza, please, your daughter should simply tell you who is responsible for her pregnancy. Because I will never accept that. And I am not going to spend my money on her. Um, so, you poke and leave. Leave my house! Leave my house before I get out of here arrested! It's annoying enough that a woman started committing a court. Please, but this, 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 this is insulting for you to come and tell me I'm responsible for our pregnancy. Baby, calm down. Ah. Yes, it's okay. Calm down. Calm down. Calm down. Calm down. I didn't stop to injure it. Please, 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 let's go. Oh. Let me see your foot here in my house again. Baby. Can you imagine this? How could they have come to my house to tell me to my face that I'm responsible for her pregnancy? What an insult. I want to ask you a question. When did the normal leave your house? That should be some months ago. When precisely? Tony, by the way, what are you trying to insinuate? <laughs> um, Obiora, let's tell ourselves the truth. I know Norma too well. And she wouldn't have come back to you if you were not responsible for that pregnancy. Tony, you're very stupid. You know, for saying that, you're very stupid. Me stupid? You heard me. <laughs> My friend, what has come over you? Look, I don't care what is going on in your mind. You can go and marry Norma and adopt her baby for all I care. It's none of my business. But for you to come and make this insinuation, look, I take exception to it. Get out of my office. I see you are out of your senses. Get out, Tony! May God have mercy on you. For more than an hour now. The sun is too hard on you. It is after three. It doesn't give anything to your body again. Mama, if 
If I should go inside now, I'll start feeling cold, eh? Let me stay here for some while. No, now. It won't favor you this way. Come, let us go inside so that I'll get some drugs for you. Mama, don't, don't worry. Let her go to the hospital and see the nurse there. She promised to take care of me till I put to bed. Yeah. But whatever, let us go inside, huh? You know? Mm. Oh. Hey! Um. Hey! Sin is believe me. Hey, hold up. Hey! Get that gang well. Oh, baby. Hey. Thank God. It's okay, it's okay. I know you're tired. Good. Chinekelele ao. Amarana chikemba timomba. Ebube boro. Kai, where are you? Kemba. Kwa mwa nene. Kasi. Le kwa ya fuma. Chikemba timomba. Taba fufu awe mo. What about the money I asked for my school fees? Hey, I forgot. I didn't even discuss it with my husband. How much did you say the money is again? So I said it's 150,000. 150,000 naira. No problem. When my husband returns, I'll tell him. Okay? Thank you. It's okay. Ah, baby. I'll believe in that. Very well, thank you. Good. Look at him. <laughs> Boy. I think he knows the father is around. Okay, see you later, Daddy. You know what? I'll just go up to my room, take my shower, and come back for you. <laughs> oh yeah, I <that> had you. <laughs> <laughs> okay, time up. Oh, uh, uh, mm. uh, yeah, how come you still shining here yeah, and you just really drop a snack? You know, you just drop another one. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, I'll be back. Okay. Get up, 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 what type of fever is this? Eh? Let me it's sound this very up. hot. Mm -hmm. There's no drugs in the house. What is happening? What is happening? Come, let me feel him. Come. It's okay. It's okay. Go and get me cold water. Be fast! Oh, 
Baba. No problem, Baba. I'll cry for you. I came to inform you that um, Ubiara's son was admitted in the hospital early this morning. Biko, which son are you talking about? I'm talking about my daughter. My daughter's baby. Huh? He was admitted this morning. Send word to Ubiara so that he can send us money to settle the hospital bill. Yeah. <laughs> huh? You're not kids. You have started again. Nikes. If you go one or So that harlot you called your daughter have not told you the father of her baby. Eh? Bridget. Hmm. You I call my daughter Harlot. You call my daughter Harlot. Give me a Please. Leave my house. Go. Because. Just go. Nobody know. Here go. Go. Don't come here again to disturb me. In a red. Nada. Go. Hey, go. No, 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 listen, listen, Bosco. Bosco, I don't want to be remembered of that accident that nearly took my life. Man, I couldn't imagine that my car somersaulted five good times. Five freaking times my car was rolling in the air. Man, Chris, did you see the car? I saw it. It was terrible. Lucky, man, so lucky. No. That reminds me. I've discovered who the dad's full station from the back. No, no, listen, Chris. Chris, now you're getting me really angry. I don't want to be reminded of those things anymore. I don't freaking care who brought my father's parties. It's not my business. So let's just enjoy ourselves. Don't remind me of those shit, please. What's that? If that's how you feel about it. But it won't stop me from telling you this. You remember your cousin brother you introduced to me some time ago? He was the one that bought those properties. Huh? Obiora? That's the name. That guy is very, very rich now. Imagine Obiara that used to beg for food. So he was the one that bought my daddy's properties for bank auction the other day. Obiara is not a big boy. Why me, Ononi, now eat from hand to mouth?
She told me that Norma's father came to our house and told her that Norma's baby is sick and that they were admitted in the hospital. Norma's baby is sick? Eh? What is Mama's business then? I think he came to tell her to send a message to me to send money for the hospital bill. What did Mama tell him? He just didn't know. She told them to go and look for the father of the baby. Uh -huh. Good. Perfect. Good. Excellent. Baby, see here. When next you travel to the village, you have to go and warn those people to leave you alone. They should leave you alone. What is their problem? Hey, what's their problem? I think that's what I should do. This disturbance is becoming too much. Ah. Anyway, um, baby, I'm worried. I had a very bad dream about you in the night. In the dream, people were after you, they were chasing you, they wanted to kill you. And you kept begging and begging and begging for them to spare your life, but they insisted they must kill you. I, I'm still trying to understand the meaning of that dream. Nothing will happen to me. You know, at times, dreams manifest in the opposite. It may just be blessing that I come in my way. <laughs> when I go and fix my bath for me again, I want to be out of this one. I do. I'll miss <laughs> you when I go out. I know. <laughs> <laughs> man out of the house and told him they should go and look for the father of the child. <laughs> Very good. Very good. That baby must die. Amen. That baby must not live. Amen. Hey! <laughs> Concerning that dream you told me about, tell your husband to be very careful. When I know my might be up to something, especially now that the paternity of our child is a question. Now that they are trying to impose the paternity of that baby on your husband, I need to be careful. Mama, are you trying to say she can't harm him because of that? Hey, Tika, you didn't just ask that question. Things are happening. I have seen where such a thing happened. Yes. <laughs> that one, eh? the woman even went man's will, with the man's name on top, till that her baby will inherit the man's wealth. But she was caught in the process. Ah, hey, Tika, people do a lot of things. People can go to any length to achieve their evil desires. Ha! This thing you're saying is so true. Ah, so, so, so true. Just tell your husband to be careful. Tell him I said that he should be careful. Okay, I'll tell him. If you should be careful too. I'm very careful. You know that. I will be leaving now. Yeah. Ah, Mama, don't worry, don't worry. Oh, okay. <laughs> that one you gave me. Just manage it. Just manage it. Yeah. 
Oh, Biosa, my brother. I am in deep trouble. The doctor has stopped uh, treating Norma's baby because of money. Huh? And they are threatening to discharge him tomorrow morning if no further money is paid. I'm in trouble. I need some money. Please help me. Help me. I'll pay you soonest. Pico. Help me, Pico. Pico, I beg you. My brother. He cares about my brother. Him now. I've had you. Excuse me. This is a uh, seven thousand naira. It's all I have in this house. That is true. Well, thank you very much. That baby's life is more important. I'm very grateful. God will continue to bless you. Thank you. Thank you. Um, come back tomorrow. Let me call my son and see if he can send more money to me so that I can give you more for the feeding. More? Ah! Uh, uh, because of my brother, I know I can always rely on you. I know I can always rely on you. Thank you. Thank you very much. This one will go a long way. Thank you. It's okay. I think I have to start going. Because I... Did you read them for me? You can get them. Thank you. Thank you.
Oh, I'm listening now. I'm here. Why ah, are you shouting? What's this? Did you sell the cloth of land at the express? I'm asking you. Oh, no, I am asking you. Yes, I sold the land. I With sold whose it. permission? Oh, no, Nenji, that plot of land is the only property left. And you sold it without my consent. I mustn't seek your consent before I would do that. Eh? It is my father's property. Okay? Yes. Come that fire your mouth. May come that fire your mouth you use in telling me this. See, let me tell you. I give you till the end of today to go and bring that money so that we will say it. In fact, split it what we've been doing. Only like, don't try me. Don't try me. Mom, listen. Listen. I am not ready to share that money with anybody. Eh? Yes. And as a matter of fact, I have already committed the money into something. Committed into what? Your numerous women? Or the drug? The sniffing? Which one? See. See this evening. That is what I'm giving you to bring that money. Wherever you kept it, go and bring it. Mom, there's no point straining. You're not seeing it. Oh, my 50 copper. Oh, my don't get me angry. You lose the 50 copper. If you get me angry, I'll hit you. You lose nothing. I'll hit your name. I'll hit you to this evening. Please, to bring that money. Let me not see that money. I'll see what I'll do to you. Be short. Train! Hello? Yeah, what's up, what's up, what's up, what's up? How's it going? Well, okay, I'll get back to you. Good. That's good, that's good. Thank you. Oh, man, it's going well. <laughs> Sent assassins after me. Uh, assassins? Hey, my God! I said it to. Eh? Ha! I didn't know they were for you. Jesus! They shot at me. Shot at me. They were determined to kill me. But God was on my side. My car took all the bullets and it's parked at the police station now. Hey! Hi! Please after me. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, thank you, Jesus. Hi! I told you what Mama said, though. I told you, but you refused to listen. Eh? I am very sure that this is Norma's handwork. She sent those assassins. If I discover that her hand is in this, she will not go scot free. Baby, what are you saying? Norma did this! <laughs> What's this, sister? Oh, sister? Go and bring my phone for me. Yes, sir. hurry up. Go and get me. My friend, go that way. My phone is in the Ah, no. I need to call my mom. Hey, my mom needs to hear this one. Hey? Oh, no, ma. Hmm. You will not let us rest, eh? No, ma. Oh, okay. What the ma? Amara, 
Is your brother back? I've not seen him. Huh. He tried calling his two phones and they're all switched off. Oh, Nonenyi is trying me. He is really trying me. If he fails to provide that money this evening, I will sell this house and all of us will go back to the village. Thank God I have the documents. No. What? Why would you say that? Eh, your brother wants to show me that he is smart. But I will tell him, I will show him I am smarter. What does he do with all the money? Only to spend it on hard drugs, women and drinks. He thinks I'm a fool, right? Just call him and tell him what I said. Rubbish. Every time sell, sell, sell in this house, we have sold all the properties my daddy left behind. And now my mom is trying to sell this house we are living in too. I'm just sick and tired of this whole thing. Hey, you're welcome. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank God. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. will you. Thank 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 you.